Hello Team Leo, it's Empire333 here with their Love Tarot card reading. I hope you're all well and safe. Hello YouTube, I am back. Got my equipment and I'm ready to rumble. So let's get into your reading. This is for Leo, wherever it's placed in your chart or if you're dealing with someone who's a Leo. Welcome everyone. So we're going to get into Oracle first, the message that is coming through. And then we'll get into each person's energy, whoever you're dealing with, whoever's in your energy field. Okay, so Leo, this is what I'm getting, okay? Some of you are losing hope when it comes to a situation. Now, this could be romantic. This could be whatever it is, okay? So it could be, you know, like career, making money, whatever. You're being asked to have faith and not lose hope. Some of you are undergoing a lot of stress at this time, and... What the message here is, is to look deeper into the situation. So I feel that some of you are not, okay, so this is what I want to say to you. The way you think you're going to get whatever it is to help you, it might be in a way that's not expected, okay? So like, let's say a scenario, like you need help with something. It could be your career. It could be your job. It could be you know, this situation. And the way you've been doing it is, is, you know, is not working out. So spirit here is asking you to look to an alternative, okay? Get the help that you need in a different form. Because if you have too much pride or ego to get that help, um, then it's not, that's what's causing you to lose faith. That's what's causing you to not get what you want. Okay. If that makes sense, let's say you want to manifest something, Leo. Okay. And you need some clarity. You need, you know, intuition. Okay. So you contact, let's say me for a personal reading. Um, maybe that's like against what you, you know, you're normally, you normally do when you, you, when you're seeking help or you want clarity, or you want like a forecast of what is going to happen, right? So you need some type of guidance. You need some type of help. And spirit is saying it's going to come in a way that you're not used to or you don't like or you don't feel comfortable with. So ask for help. It's okay to ask for help. That doesn't make you less of a person. It doesn't make you needy, okay? Just like how you always help people, right? You always help people, Leo. I know Leos, okay? And you all are very helpful. You all are very, you know, from the Leos I know at least. So don't be afraid to ask for help, okay? In a way that you're not comfortable with. That's the whole point. Spirit is sending you help, but it's not in the way you're used to, okay? I hope that makes sense. <laughs> all right, Leo. So yeah, ask for the help that you need, okay? So, um, oh yeah, you all, so I might extend this reading, okay, for further spiritual advice about the story. That will be down below in the description box. If not, I'll let you know during the reading, but if not still, I am open for personal readings and that information is down below, okay? So let's get into um, the person that you are dealing with, Leo, okay, with this deck right here. Okay, wow. Let's see. Okay, so I see here that there's someone who is currently blocking you, okay? It could be that, you know, it doesn't necessarily mean like they're literally blocking you on their phone or on social media, but I feel that this person, um, is their focus is not you at this time, okay? And I see that the reason is, look at you, you're in this, you're in here, Leo. Look at you, you're roaring, right? This person doesn't want to fight with you, okay? They have realized that you both haven't reached like 
um, a peaceful resolution, okay? So in the past, maybe you both butted heads, Leo. It was that kind of energy. And now this person is just like, um, I feel like they're not focusing on it. But what I'm seeing here is that there is this person here wants to reach a breakthrough okay so maybe this connection got stale or there was like lack of communication or it's it's kind of like this person um i feel like this person wanted to be alone for some reason if that makes sense and what i'm seeing here is like they want to have a conversation they want to have a breakthrough i feel like you both have a history together okay some of you have like a long-term history together with this person. Whether it be platonic or not, it doesn't matter. But this person wants some type of communication, but it's very daunting to them is what I'm hearing. Communicating with you is daunting to them. Leo, let me know what you did to this person. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm just t telling you what's coming through from their perspective, okay? So let's see about you and then we'll go back to your person okay so let's see wow okay wow so you all had a tower moment some of you might have found out okay i'm not getting this for a lot of you but there's a group of you who found out this person like they're um associating with someone else it could be like um a baby mama or something like that okay but that's not for a lot of you that's just for a group of you um let's see okay okay so Leo, you definitely had a big falling out with this person. I feel that you both like have more freedom because of this. You know, you both have like liberation because of this. Something went down, okay? There was some type of maybe surprise or a secret came out or something about the situation, okay? But Regardless, Leo, whatever you're trying to pick up, I feel like some of you are trying to pick up the pieces because this person, regardless of the fact that you might have had a history with them, okay, or you've known them for a long time, it's like they're being so cold. They're being so, um, I'm hearing immature about like this whole situation, right? But you're moving forward. I feel like a lot of you are learning something at this time, okay? There is, this is what it is, Leo, okay? Some of you were so fixated on having um, a commitment with this person that you didn't really pay attention to the, to the dynamics of this connection, like how this person is behaving, what attention they're giving you how they're loving you, it's that kind of thing, right? You paid attention so much to where this is going to go and the, the behavior of this person or the boundaries were not set and it just kind of fell, like it just kind of um, fell through the cracks, this connection, okay? So here, there is something that, you need to be doing some of you it's it's kind of like this has to do with your career okay or it has to do with some type of service that you need to be giving people and at this time you're being directed to that okay this person does want to have a talk with you they do i feel like commun they want to communicate with you to know like is this you know is this, are we going to have a new beginning? Are we not? What's going on? Okay, so they feel the same as you. So let's see this person, okay, what they want. What does this person want? 
go. Wow, okay. This is interesting. This person does want you. This person does want to get back with you. It's kind of like, you know where what this is going to, Leo? You and this person, you've had, um, some of you have been through a lot together. And what I'm getting here is that things got stagnant between you two. And this person wants some kind of movement where it's kind of like, okay, let's, we need to have a talk kind of thing, right? So this person also wants to know what, what can become of this, right? Um, because their wish is to be with you, but I feel that that energy is not grounded into the, like, into the physical plane. They want to make a judgment about this connection, okay? So it's judgment time. And some of you, you want it too, Leo. Like, you were like, okay, I need this person to make a decision. Like, I want to know, am I going to have a new beginning? Should I move on from this person? There's all these things going through your head right now. Let's see. Ooh, Emperor. Wow. Okay, yes. Yeah, this person, okay, it's like there's been a, um, how should I say it? A stalemate energy between you two, okay? This person... Look at all the horses we got in here. Um, this person in the past, I feel, they didn't make any moves. It's like this person is ready to make a move and they want to know. They want to know, Leo, <coughs> excuse me, if this will, this needs to have a new beginning, basically, okay? This person wants to know whether, like, they're coming out of some type of, you know, maybe they're ignoring you, Leo. Maybe they're blocking you. I, I feel like for some of you, that's, that's true. Let me know in the comments. I'm not going to extend this reading, by the way, because I'm getting a split reading. But this person, it's like you're both waiting for each other right now. You're both waiting for each other. Like who's going to make the next move? They want to make the move, but... um. They are scared that you're going to reject them because last time you were really mad, okay? So they're kind of like, it's daunting. I keep getting, it's daunting for them to communicate with you, but they do. They want to communicate with you. They want to know, is this a yes? Is this a no? Are we going to move forward? What are we going to do, okay? Or are we going to, you know, say goodbye forever? It's like, that is it. Is it time to say goodbye, Leo? Like, is it really that time? Because some of you, um, you that's what Spirit is trying to say here. You need to focus on the dynamics of this connection and not the labels of it. Okay? I mean, what? this is what it is, Leo. You need to tell this person what you want. But, like, if you want marriage, if you want commitment, whatever it is you want from this person, you need to tell them is the advice here. But it's like, don't fixate on that label. Try to set, set plans in place if you still want this person. But this person definitely, I feel, they are gathering up the courage to um, reach out to you. Because they want to know too. They want to know. It's like, let's see. Oh, wow. Whew. Yeah. This person, I feel, will reach out to you 
Okay. Um, but it's kind of like, it's so, it's so scary for both of you because you want to know if it's, this is going to be over, over like forever. I feel like this person is scared too, that they'll lose you forever. So I don't know if this is an on and off. Some of you I'm getting, this is a very on and off in and out connection, but there is definitely like, how should I say this? It's like breakthrough. There's some type of a breakthrough here, okay? We got the Ace of Cups. So I feel that whatever happens in this conversation, you all, it's going to change both of your lives, okay? And some of you might make the necessary changes to um, to have a new beginning with this person and others of you will decide to go separate ways, okay? But regardless, I think that um, I'm hearing apologies are overdue. So there might be like a peace offering regardless. There's going to be some type of a peaceful resolution to this connection, okay? And, um, so you're going to figure out regardless, Leo. So be prepared when this person comes, I keep seeing like a uh, peace. So there is some type of a peace offering between you and this person. If it was very like tumultuous, your connection, there's going to be peace offering. There is going to be for some of you, a renewal of love. Okay. When love didn't you know, um, love was stagnant, there was passion being lost and all that kind of stuff. Okay. If that makes sense. So, all right. They want me to look at the bottom. Yeah, definitely. This person is going to reach out to you. Okay. They're going to reach out to you, Leo, be prepared. Do not be in fight mode because regardless of how this person is coming to you deep down inside of them, they do have a lot of strong feelings for you. Okay. Regardless of the way they've acted in the past, they've ignored you. They have blocked you or been very resistant towards changing this connection or behaving in the way you want to. This person is coming to you. And um, whether you decide to leave this person or not, there's definitely new love here for you is what I'm hearing. Okay. So there's a new love that will come in regardless whether you both say goodbye for good or whatever. There is new love. Okay. But Spirit is saying here, make sure that you um, make peace with this person, okay? I'm talking to whoever is watching this, regardless who you are. You need to make peace with each other, is what they're saying, okay? So, Leo, I hope you enjoy this message. It's brought you clarity. If it has, don't forget to like this video. Let me know in the comments how you resonate with the storyline. And subscribe if you like my vibe and my style of reading. Wishing you all the best, Leo, and peace out.